Previously on Cat Clips. After the cats try on costumes, their Halloween plans are rudely interrupted by Superstorm Sandy, which knocks their power out and keeps them in the dark for over a week. Then this happened. Cat Clips! Cat Clips! Cat Clips! Cat Clips! Still no power after 12 days, so the only way to keep warm is to keep moving. <laughs> that is, if your bones don't snap like icicles first. And what has happened to my sense of smell? Everything is beginning to have the same scent. Like it's all ice ice, baby. I know. This is the seventh time I've tried smelling these boxes, and I still can't name that odor. At least it's sunny during the day, or we'd really be in trouble. I hope this ends soon, or- oh, oh, it's you, Tuck. You scared me. All work and no play makes Tuck a dull boy. What? What are you talking about? All work and no play makes Tuck a dull boy. Ow, Tuck! You're hurting me! Hail! Tuck, stop it! What are you doing? Trey, say something! Red rum! Uh, Tuck, knock it off. I know you're going stir-crazy, but this is not The Shining, and you are not Jack Nicholson. What? Where am I? Oh, I am so sorry, Boots. I don't know what came over me. It was like I was in a cold snap. Sounds like something else might have snapped. You just need to find something to distract you. Try playing with these boxes for a while. Or shake, shake, shake your booty. Great idea, Trey. If Tuck is beginning to lose his marbles, getting him to think inside the box is probably a great sedative. Who knew 12 days without TV and internet could be so damaging to your psyche? These green boxes are all right, I guess, but what am I supposed to do with them? Half the box is already open. Where's the challenge in that? The challenge is to use your imagination. Pretend the boxes are something different. Like that scrap of paper over there. It could be a mouse. Gotcha! Or maybe it could be a ticking bomb and you have to detonate it before it explodes. Quick, do I cut the red wire or green or blue or... Got it. Wait, there's another one. Oh no, the clock says three, two, one. <gasps> Chippy? Chippy, are you all right? What happened? Did the bomb explode? Did you get out in time? Chippy, answer me. I'm fine. Wait, the other bomb is still ticking. I didn't detonate it properly. And I snipped here, I snipped there. Got it. Snap, I should have been in the herd locker. I remember when I used to pretend, back when I was a kitten. It's funny how everything seemed so possible when you were young. Oh, cry me a river. Wait till you get to be in my position when there's nothing left to pretend. Okay, I'm pretending this is a giant alligator mouth and I'm trapped inside it. So I've got to scratch and bite my way out. Take that, you mean alligator. Nobody puts Tucker in a molar. Um, wait a minute. Is an alligator the aggressive one or is it a crocodile? I think it's the crocodile. They hide among that tall grass, quietly watching their prey until the moment comes when they attack. Poor piece of paper, it never stood a chance. That's how I felt when Tuck held me in that headlock before, like I was in a crocodile's jaws. I'm so embarrassed. I don't know why I did that. I love you, Boots. I would never do anything to hurt you purposely. Oh, I know. You just had a flash mental breakdown. It happens. It's just so frustrating to be without heat or electricity. Especially since the street right behind us has had it for over a week. Makes me so angry I want to chew someone out. Yeah, if I ever see a PSENG executive, I'll give him a piece of my claw. Take that, Wonder Feline! Hmm, 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 hmm. Looks like the PSC and G guys are finally working on our power lines. What? Are you serious? Don't tease me now. I don't think my faint-hearted fur could take it. It's true. They have two bucket trucks out there and they're doing all kinds of stuff with the cables. 
Oh, this is so exciting to have electricity again and hot water and cable TV. Yeah, we don't even know who's been eliminated from the X Factor yet. Who cares about that? I'm dying to know what happened on Revenge. <laughs> well, not dying, I mean... <laughs> and I want to watch all the Halloween episodes we missed. I'll just be glad to have a warm heater to lie on again, where I can stretch out and fry my fur like a fine flambe. Ho <laughs> ho! And it sure will be nice not to have to lie on my feet all the time to keep them warm. I know what you mean! Hey, what happened? I'm seeing spots before my eyes! Look! The overhead light is on! The electricity is back! Wahoo! Which makes this the perfect time to hit the like button with my friends Aqua Brody, Jewel Fordyce, Jerome Rush, and Lips Shine Lion or something. And a one and a two and a three click it! Thanks everyone! We're finally part of civilization again! Yay! <laughs> Catlins! Catlins!